My mother would like to speak in her language. Eileen Spears, Nisikasun, Nya Oste, Cree Nation. My name is Eileen Spears. I am from the Cree Nation in Manitoba, Canada. Art and, you know, current events seem to have really sparked on Bones of Crows because obviously we were shooting at the same time uh, the 215 uh, children at Kamloops uh, Indian Residential school, school. So we were literally shooting in the residential school and looking out the windows and seeing the memorial site. In some ways it made it even more real, you know, it made it really that we had to do it and we had to do it right. This is our country, this is our history. Um, and I, I guess what I'd love to see is that, that audiences understand this is our history, this is our shared history. And so um, we have to look at that, we have to look at our part and things that aren't pleasant and really address it and have those conversations. So I, I think, strangely, in the world there's still people that don't know about residential schools, don't know that uh, it was a government policy and that it was, you know, 150 years in the making. And, and so I think when you look at that kind of legacy, you kind of go, well, why don't we know it intimately? You know, this is a part of our, this is where we live. This yeah. is, you know, so I think that, that in itself is, is um, I think, important, but also the idea to have, uh, I always love that, that people watch movies or read books so that they can have, di you know, it can bring up dialogue and it can, maybe we can argue a bit about things and we can see where we, we agree and where we don't agree. Um, and I think those things are important if we really want change, you know, if you want change in the world. I hope that they learn something from this and they, they take it home to their families and, and they're really able to educate other people and share a little piece of it and and just be able to carry it on for generations to come and not stop, like do not stop learning, do not stop being open. This is very hard work and watching this is going to bring up a lot of emotion and I hope that we hold our loved ones very close and we go through this together and support our communities and for non-Indigenous folks I hope that they start a conversation and they talk to three people and really, really look into the true history of so-called Canada.